Mike D'Antoni, born May 8, 1951, is a former American basketball player and current head coach of the Los Angeles Lakers. While head coach of the NBA's Phoenix Suns, he won NBA Coach of the Year honors for the 2004-05 NBA season after the Suns posted 33 more wins than the previous season. He coached the New York Knicks starting in 2008 before resigning in 2012. He was hired by the Lakers midseason in 2012-13. D'Antoni, who holds American and Italian dual citizenship, is known for favoring a fast-paced offense-oriented system. Playing career, after a college career at Marshall University, D'Antoni was drafted by the Kansas City Omaha Kings in the second round of the 1973 NBA Draft. He was All-NBA Rookie Second Team Choice for 1974. After three seasons for the Kings, 1973-1976, he played for the Spirits of St. Louis of the American Basketball Association in 1976, and for the San Antonio Spurs, again in the NBA in 1977. His Spurs career lasted just two games before he found an opportunity to play successfully overseas. D'Antoni was then called by the Italian team of Olympia Milano, starting a career which saw him become the club's all-time leading scorer. He was voted the league's top point guard of all time in 1990 and he paced his team to five Italian league titles, two Euro League titles, two Cups of Italy, one Coral Cup and one Intercontinental Cup. Being of Italian origin, D'Antoni was also selected to play on the Italian national team for the European Championship in 1989. Coaching career, Italy D'Antoni began his career as head coach for his most loyal club, Milan. He remained for four seasons, from 1990 to 1994, leading the club to the 1992 European Championship Final Four and 1993 Korak Cup. He was then chosen to coach Benetton Treviso, another major Italian basketball club. During his tenure, 1994-1997, the team captured the Cup of Europe and Coppa Italia in 1995 and won the National League title in 1996-97. Coach D'Antoni's Italian teams went to the playoffs each season, and he was twice voted the league's coach of the year. In 2001, D'Antoni returned to Italy for a second stint as the coach of Benetton Treviso. In his one season back in Europe, he led the team to a 28-8 record, a league championship and 2002 Euro League Final Four, coaching the team filled with many former NBA stars. Early NBA The first NBA coaching job held by D'Antoni was with the Denver Nuggets in 1997-98 as the club's director of player personnel. He also did some broadcasting work with TNT during that season. The next year, he became Nuggets head coach, but was fired after a poor performance during the strike-shortened 1998-99 season. D'Antoni then went on to become a scout for San Antonio Spurs during the 1999-2000 season. He was also an assistant for the Portland Trailblazers in 2001. Phoenix Suns D'Antoni coaching the Suns in 2002, D'Antoni made his return to the NBA as a Phoenix Suns assistant. In 2003, he was hired with 61 games left in the season as the head coach of the Phoenix Suns and, despite leading the team to a poor record in the second half of the year, he received a vote of confidence for producing inspired play from an injury-riddled team. The next season, D'Antoni helped the team acquire Steve Nash, which began an incredible turnaround for the franchise. After the addition of Nash, the D'Antoni coach Suns won 50 or more games in four consecutive seasons. D'Antoni won the NBA Coach of the Year award during his first full season with the Suns. His style, dubbed, seven seconds or less, was described in a book of that name. Team USA 
D'Antoni was selected to the coaching staff for the Team USA Olympic basketball squad under head coach Mike Krzyzewski and participated in the 2006 FIBA World Championship, winning a bronze medal. Pundits believed his familiarity with the three-point shot and the zone defense, hallmarks of the international game, were considered to be valuable assets to the team. New York Knicks D'Antoni coaching the New York Knicks in 2009. As of May 5, 2008, D'Antoni was told that he was free to speak with other teams about a coaching job next season, although Steve Carr requested he stay with the Suns. On May 9, D'Antoni was made an offer by the New York Knicks. The next day, D'Antoni accepted the four-year, $24 million offer and became the Knicks head coach. After two tough years, D'Antoni finally saw some success with the Knicks during the 2010-11 NBA season. The team brought in stars like Amari Stoudemire and Carmelo Anthony, and the Knicks qualified for the playoffs with a 42-40 record before getting swept by the Boston Celtics in the first round of the playoffs. D'Antoni resigned as coach on March 14, 2012, and assistant coach Mike Woodson filled his vacancy as the head coach. The Knicks were off to a disappointing 18-24 start. Return to Team USA for 2012 London Olympics In the summer of 2012, D'Antoni returned to Team USA as an assistant coach again under head coach Mike Krzyzewski. He reunited with Knicks players Carmelo Anthony and Tyson Chandler on this team as they prepared for the 2012 London Summer Olympics. Los Angeles Lakers On November 12, 2012, the Lakers signed D'Antoni to a multi-year contract. He replaced Mike Brown, who was fired as head coach after a 1-4 start to the 2012-13 season. Former Lakers coach Phil Jackson was the early favored to replace Brown, but D'Antoni was hired in a unanimous decision by the Lakers' front office. The move was widely questioned by the media. D'Antoni was reunited with Nash, who was traded to the Lakers before the season. Lakers star Kobe Bryant was also familiar with D'Antoni. Bryant as a child knew him when D'Antoni was a star in Italy and Bryant's father was also playing there. Bryant grew close with D'Antoni during their time with Team USA. 